Hello, this is Paramjit Singh. So whenever we think about addictive behaviors and substances, what sort of things that comes to your mind? Most likely it would be like cocaine, hashish, ganja, painkillers, sleeping pills, opium. Does it ever cross your mind that work, especially the industrialized concept of work, could also be addictive and possibly harm or possibly harmful? And because we often don't think of work in the terms of harm. It may be just flying under the radar for all it does to our mental and physical well-being. Of course, work does a lot of good things to our mental and physical well-being. But could, that, could it also be possible that the present-day industrialized work also does some if not very, harm to our well-being. The way we work, the way the work of a week is stretched out, the way we have blurred the lines between home and offices, the way the communication has erased almost every barrier between work and life. So in my conversation, or in our conversation yesterday, in one of our medicine class, we were talking about all the things which eats into our resilience, our capacity to recover from the setbacks. And we talked about various things. But then we came to this one thing that, what about our work? The way we work, the way we take pride in doing a 60 hours a week work, the way we take pride in spending sleepless nights, pulling through all nighters, or looking down upon how people value rest and recovery or sleep. And there was not much answer to that question. And in fact, I have asked that question to many people. And it seems like that we have settled with the idea of work. That we are trying to find this a kind of a holy grail where we can eat the cake and have it also. But when it comes to human body, I think that is not possible. At least not so far. We have not found a way where you can have the cake and eat it also. Because body respond to wear and tear. Body needs sleep. Body needs recovery. Body needs sunlight. Body needs movement to some extent. But our work is very different. It's industrialized. It's based on this industrial efficiency where you are always trying to figure out what is the best way to enhance productivity? And as much as reasonable that aspiration is, it does have a negative impact on the way we think of work and the way the work influences our day-to-day, -day, our life. So I don't want to belabor the point here, but I wanted to throw a question at you. That do you think the way you work and the way the work occupy its space in your life has something to do the way you feel mentally and the way you feel physically? And if the answer comes yes, even to some extent, how can you redefine your relationship with your work? 
because some work has to be done we it provides subsistence to us but the industrial notion of work for efficiency and productivity can be really harmful so the question i want to leave you with is that to what extent your notion of work and the way you approach work and your work week is impacting your day to day lived experience and if you think it has something to do the way you feel in your mind and in your body what would you do to change it differently how can you reconfigure your relationship with work so it is healthy that it is useful it is meaningful it may not be as productive and as efficient as industrial efficiency requires us to do but efficiency would be meaningless so how can you make your work meaningful and useful and purposeful and helpful for your own mental sanity and physical well-being anyhow that's the question i wanted to ask you if you have any thoughts about this topic or if you have thought about work as a part of the addictive behaviors the way we use work to escape from the troubles of our life the way we fill up our calendars the way we occupy every waking moment doing something without leaving any space for things which can make our life more meaningful and you would like to share it i would love to have a conversation with you so thank you so much for stopping by if you find this conversation useful kindly subscribe share like press the bell icon so that each time we upload a new video you will get a automatic notification if you have any topics you would like me to cover kindly send an email to me or leave it in the comment section i will do my best to cover that topic in the meantime continue to stay curious and reasonably non judgmental but do ask the question about the kind of work and the space it occupies in your life thank you very much see you again next time bye bye for now please subscribe to the channel like and share thank you <laughs>